What's up guys, in today's video I'm going to show you how to destroy cover 3 defense. And if you're like me, you're getting a ton of cover 4 and cover 3 and you're just flat out tired of it. So, uh, we're going to jump into this right now. What's up guys, my name is Cody. I want to thank you for watching today's video. If you have not already subscribed yet, maybe this is your first time watching, I want to encourage you to go ahead and click that subscribe button. We give out 4 free Madden tips and tricks every Every single day here on my YouTube channel. I post four videos a day. I also live stream and play with members of my Discord server. So if you haven't joined the Discord yet, there's a link in the description for that. But I live stream and basically play uh, with members and then I answer questions live every night at 10 o'clock p.m. Eastern time. We will be live tonight. We're going to be doing a very long stream. I'm very, very excited right now because I have some really, really good material for you out of our Arizona Cardinals playbook. Now, if you've never uh, heard me talk about the air raid offense or the Arizona Cardinals offense, you know that if you've never heard it before, those that follow me know I love Arizona Cardinals. I love the Arizona playbook. I love the air raid. I love Mike Leach, Hal Mummy, the founding fathers of this great, great offense. And I try to duplicate it in Madden. And basically, I wrote an entire guide on this, over 89 pages of material. And if you haven't picked up the ebook, you can in the description. But this is a play that I haven't covered in the ebook. And a little bit of a, it's really not a play, it's more of a concept. But this is going to help you absolutely torch cover three. So it comes from the Arizona Cardinals playbook. The play we're going to be utilizing is post dig. This literally destroys every single cover three defense in Madden 21. We're going to show you this right now. So I'm just going to come out in dollar uh three dollar three two six cover three press and what you're going to see here is all we're going to do is we're going to take you can do it with saint brown here i personally like to leave him on that dig route both of these guys do beat man-to-man -man coverage by the way but all we're going to do is take marquez valdez scantling and put him on a fade route and then i'm just going to motion mercedes lewis out and snap the ball once he gets to the outside here. So you see, this is what you're going to look, this is literally what the play looks like. Snap of the ball, and what you're going to see is the cover three is literally just torched. You're just bombs away, touchdown, one play score. This destroys cover three. Now, I'll show you one other thing that they can do. And the cool part about this play um, is you can do multiple things with this. I mean, you could even put the running back on a streak and beat cover three if you wanted to. But you'll see right here, there it is. That's shaded coverage over top. Cover three is just dotted. I mean, there's just nothing that they can do. Now, the one thing that they're going to be able to do that's going to kind of help a little bit is if they flip their cover three. So we'll show you that real quick. And this just means you're probably just going to have to wait a little bit longer. And that's why I personally like the fade route because he gets a little bit of an outside cut on this. But what you'll see here, there's the cover three. And I'm just going to pass lead it to the outside. And I mean, look, you're just torching cover three all day long. This play kills cover three. Now, what's nice about it is you have a very, very simple route combination over the middle of the field that is going to work well against really every other coverage in the game. I mean, if they run man, if they run cover four, you're going to be able to hit. I mean, this post route right here um, is really, really effective. What you can do with Devontae Adams is you can literally smart route him. So you see here, if I smart route him, it's going to turn him into basically a, a glorified slant cross type of route. And what's going to happen is if they're running the cover three, and obviously you see here, we can throw that route to Vada Scantling all day long. But literally, you see that see see where the deep cross route gets that deep slant post gets in a very tender area of the field as well. But this cluster formation, I think, is very very underrated. Again, that little motion out of the tight end. If they're running cover three on you, if you've been getting torched by cover three, it's time to stop letting people call cover three all game long. And it's time for you to start getting one play touchdowns against it. So that is a phenomenal cover three beater, in my opinion. Very, very simple to use and very, very effective. I do want to show you really quickly. Uh, we'll just go through the other, other coverages just real briefly here. So if they run cover four, you'll see. That cover four will do okay against this. You'll see here on that outside. Uh, but you can hit this wheel route. That's the thing. If those those deep blues fall back, you can hit the wheel route at the snap of the ball. So it's not necessarily, you know, oh, I'm just going to call cover four and be good. No, not really. I mean, you know, you're going to still be vulnerable to other portions of the defense. I mean, this motion out wheel route. And then here is cover two. Basically with cover two, what I like to do is just let him get over the cloud. And then you can hit him over the top. 
the other thing I would say against cover two is you can hit your middle. I mean, your middle routes are going to get open very, very, very uh, well. Uh, let me see. Let me reset the play. But, yeah, I mean, cover three just literally doesn't stand a chance. Let me show you uh, St. Brown on the streak, too, just to show you. Um, it doesn't matter which one you use. So if you want that underneath little zig route for man coverage, maybe if, maybe if they accidentally call cover one or, or whatever you guess wrong and they're in a man coverage, what you'll see is with this specific route, um, when when you if you leave circle on that little zig, that zig is going to get pretty decent percent, uh, positioning. So he's just going to come in and he's going to cut. And then if you have good route running there, there was clearly a, an advantage to Jair Alexander. But if that's Devontae Adams or you have a slot o -matic or something like that, you know, you'll be just fine. But, you know, you can just torch cover three with this play. Uh, real quick before we take off, I do want to encourage you, if you haven't already joined my text message membership, it's 100% free to do that. And all you got to do is text me. Again, just shoot uh, shoot me your name. Let me know you want to be in the text membership. My number is 812-216-3644. It is my personal cell phone number. Um, so you're not going to get any, you know, auto text or whatever. Um, you know, it's, it's just, you know, just trying to give you guys as much access to me as I possibly can. We did start our online CFM or we did start taking registrations for that. So if you want more information about that, the best way to do that is just to text me. Um, if you haven't already paid your entry free, entry fee your team is not saved so make sure you pay your entry free entry fee so that you can get the team that you uh want in the cfm because we start on wednesday so excited about that we got more videos coming for you today thanks for watching and we'll see you tonight on stream at 10 o'clock p.m eastern